Hello friends, how are you? This is Dr. Shinagi, Ayurveda and Medicine doctor and also Isha Hatta Yoga teacher. So today in this video, we are going to talk about food. Many times this happen, whenever, whenever we eat food, we feel sleepy. Usually food is designed to provide us energy, but why this happen? Like whenever I have food, I feel a lot of sleep, a lot of dizziness and immediately after having food, I go to bed or I immediately feel sleepy and I am not able to sit and I just lie down and I sleep. So let's see what Ayurveda has to say about it. If you are also feeling sleepy after having food, immediately after food, then maybe you are also doing these eight mistakes which are the most common reasons for having sleep immediately after food or laziness. Many times we try to be very health conscious and we did do this common mistake like we have joined some gym or some you know sports club or anything like that so we don't want to go in sports club hungry and we immediately eat food and then we run to sports club so that we don't feel sleepy and uh, you know it's good utilization of food and more ATP or like more energy would be there for exercise this is very common myth that people are doing uh, which is not according to Ayurveda because according to Ayurveda uh, immediately after having food whole your blood supply will go to your stomach to your mesentery to your food to make it digest because whenever we eat food digestive fire act on it and whole over our energy blood circulation goes towards the stomach or intestine side and there is very less blood supply in our uh, these uh, limbs so when we are doing rigorous exercise or after having food a lot of exertion if we do or a lot of dancing if we do a lot of clubbing if not clubbing but dancing if we do we go to desk and a lot of energetic things if we do so what will happen hold the blood from your stomach area goes to other parts uh, of your body like limbs hands legs because a lot of energy is needed over there now there is very less blood supply in the stomach which is also needed for digestion so now what will happen there it will be this process if you're doing it it will weaken our digestive fire and we will even after doing a lot of exercises and proper going to gym we will uh, develop stomach issues sometimes IBS sometimes bloating sometimes digestion issues sometimes irritation all these things will happen because there is not enough digestive fire which can digest your food properly and if food remain indigested it will cause nutritional deficiency and iron deficiency mineral deficiency because everything get absorbed from the digested food by the body so it's very important that we pay attention the food should be well digested then only we can build our health or our body next common mistake that we do after having food is drinking a big glass of water immediately after food whenever we are having food and immediately after having food if you're drinking big glass of water or two glasses of water it will totally lower down your digestive fire and which will result in bloating uh, abnormal uh, bloating stomach pain indigestion constipation and again uh, it will result in indigested food which is not good for health and also maybe it will give rise to uh, the formation of toxins which invite various chronic ailments so it's very very important that immediately after having food you don't drink water you please wait for one hour and then only drink big amount of water or at least half hour or immediately if you're feeling very very thirsty then drink water but make the temperature of water liter on the hotter side or take or one or two sips if it's utter emergency uh, never drink water immediately after food because it will lower down your digestion it will di lower down your digestive fire and that will uh, cause uh, various stomach issues so this is the very common mistake that food started no digestion of food will not happen proper and there will be no energy and you will feel sleepy so this is one of the reasons why you feel sleepy 
Next common mistake which we do which is totally big mistake so that our body will not create toxins in the system that is having fruit after food. Uh, there are many, uh, this is myth like we will not eat sugar sweets, but we will e eat natural fruits. So many times this happen like people are replacing uh, uh, these sugars or sugary sweets with natural fruits hoping like we are doing very healthy change. But this is according to Ayurveda is totally wrong and even from yoga perspective also it is totally wrong because these fruits. Uh, takes less time to digestion for digestion and these grains and food it take more time to digestion and these grains and food uh, in a way because it takes more time to digest and uh, it will block the pathway of the fruit which get digested very early immediately after food if you are taking some fruit and then rotting of the fruit will start and it will start giving toxins to the system not because the absorption of the fruit will not happen because absorption will happen in intestine and we have uh, first taken a grain diet and then we took fruit. Fruit got digested in stomach but the pathway of the fruit that it will go to intestine it is blocked by uh, your solid food because it takes 4 hours to digest. So, it will also cause very uh, bad sensation, constipation, uh, irritable bowel syndrome, stomach issues, gas, bloating and you will make this perception that I am allergic to fruit or fruit does not suit me. But it is not truth, whenever you want to eat fruit, first eat fruits and then solid food uh, except for mango because mango is considered as like pakwa fruit means it can be eaten after food even. But all other foods should be eaten before food including salads and uh, because mango, mango is uh, more hot in potency and this kind of fruit can be eaten after food but all other foods should be eaten empty stomach. So that the digestion because mango is equally like if it is fully ripe mango it uh, equally designates as a cooked food because it is cooked by natural sun. So, this kind of mango you can eat after food in, at, uh, and in many parts of India where there are a lot of mangoes, they are even eating mango with grain and it gives good health. But all other fruits you need to eat empty stomach because they get digested very quickly within 2 hours and you should never eat any fruit after having grains because it can block the uh, pathway of your uh, digestive system. Next most common mistake that we do is immediately after food we go to shower. Many times this happen at we come back from we came back home from uh, late night work and uh, we are very very hungry and immediately first we eat food and then we feel very dirty also and then immediately we go to after food we immediately we go to shower and then take shower. This will also disturb your digestive fire according to Ayurveda because uh, all the uh, that digestive fire or energy or blood that has gone to your stomach for digestion of food it will go to your limbs because body wants to keep its maintain its temperature. Once you are putting some cold water shower or something then body has to maintain its temperature and that is why all the blood from the stomach will go to your limbs to maintain the uh, homeostasis that is body temperature that is the phenomena in our body and in this case also your food will not get digested well and you feel sleepy, lack of energy, no proper minerals, no proper nutrition because there is not enough digestive fire to digest the food. So these were the common mistakes that people do unknowingly hoping that we are doing good for our health but actually it uh, works against our health. So that is all about today's video. Thank you so much for watching and if you are watching me for the first time there is a bell icon, there is a subscription button. Please click the bell icon, hit the subscription button so that you stay in tune with our upcoming videos. Also if you would like to support us there is a join button near subscription button. Please click this join button and support us. If you have any questions please write down those questions in the comment section and I will try to answer your questions in the best possible way. Those of you who want Ayurveda consultations please write to me on this given email id and I will let you know how we can schedule it. So with this note I would like to say stay healthy, stay blessed, take care, bye.